10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 5, 10, 15, and 20. Oh my gosh, I feel so awkward with doing that count. <laughs> to another video my name is Simone and here on my channel I will be talking about all things related to finances that is budgeting debt management sprinkled with a little bit of investment as well as saving those coins in order to create generational wealth for myself and my family um, if those topics are of interest to you then please continue to watch okay ladies and gentlemen um today i will be stuffing two um binders and they are my business uh sinking funds binder as well as my home sweet home binder i introduced uh, this binder actually in my last video so if you want to go check that out you can but i'll do like a full recap when it's time to stuff this binder so let's um count some money and get right into the video i have some funds in here but i also have some in the back right here in my business binder i'll be stuffing a total of 50 dollars, and then in my home sweet home binder i'll be putting 70 dollars. so in total that's one 120 so let's just do like a quick count to make sure that i have 120 but i'm almost sure it's 120. let me just count quickly i'll start from the back 10 20 30 40 50. so that's 50. 55 60 65 70 75 80 85 90 95 100 105 10 15 and 20 so 120 i am going to start off with my business sink and funds binder so first up is my uh, subscription and subscription will be getting a ten dollar let me just see i have trackers and you know what? I'm going to put these off to the side, fill those out after. Let me see if I can mark anything off. I'm going to put a 10. So subscription now has 10, 20, and 25. So I can color in one of the little things. Let me just get my colors here. Okay, I'll just do like... Try to make it look all fancy. Definitely not staying in the line, so it is what it is. I'll just do that because I'm not gonna get too fancy with it. All right. So $25 in subscription. Next up is marketing, and marketing will be getting five dollars. So marketing now has five, ten, and fifteen. Not enough to mark off one of the icon because each icon is worth ten dollars. So when I add another five, I can definitely do some coloring there okay uh, YouTube will be getting five dollars and that is for any future investments that I want to make in YouTube that be in equipment or giveaways and all of that good stuff so YouTube I said is getting five dollars so YouTube now has 10, 15, and 20. So I could definitely color in an icon because one each icon is worth 
do I have a gray? I kind of want to do like a gray and a red. Or no, actually, I'll make it look like this. So I'll just do like red. So it really looks like the actual YouTube icon. So that's it. P.O. Box is up and P.O. Box is getting $10. So P.O. Box now has 20, 30, 35, and each icon is worth $20. So I need five more in order to color in one of the icons. office supplies and y'all I've been doing so good with my ink I'm usually printing stuff like crazy but lately I've been okay so five dollars for office supply so office supply now has 10 15 and 20 and I most definitely get to color in one of these little icon so I'm going to color this one because I had um, a book before so let me just go ahead and color this this one in I'm trying to be a little fancy. All right. Let me just go ahead and put that back. Okay, the dreadful taxes is getting $5. I should definitely put a lot more in here because if anybody knows about business tax then you know it's so much more than just like regular tax i think last year when i did my business tax for my boutique i um paid three hundred dollars and this year i'll be paying i think roughly six hundred so business tax is a little crazy but it is what it is, but I'm not saving up. This money will not cover for this year's tax. I will be saving for next year's business tax. But I kind of just clump it all up in here. So business tax now has 10, 20, 25. So I need five more dollars in order to color an icon. So um, Boss Babe is my last one. Yep. So Boss Babe will be getting $10. And this is for any supplies that I need for my online boutique. Um, I'm just saving for future. At the current moment, I'm just like buying stuff, but not from this, but I'm trying to discipline myself to save in order to make like future future purchases but I definitely have to get new inventory for the summer which I kind of already did and I can't wait to put those on the website so I can color in an icon actually I'm gonna choose purple this time just to switch it up a little bit and then maybe like a blue just to make things look a little colorful so that's it my boss babe has twenty dollars that can't buy any inventory by any means but we're slowly getting 
there the goal is to try to save for future expenses as opposed to just like spend it now because that's what got your girl in debt all right so that is all done let me just put that there all right so moving on to my home sweet home binder um i showed you guys this in my last video so I'm really happy about this binder because it's helping me to prepare for home ownership, which I'm very excited about. So let's just jump right into it. So mortgage, and I am doing one for mortgage in my other binder. I am actually doing a sinking funds for my down payment, as well as my overall saving challenges. Um, are definitely going towards a down payment for a new home as well as to clear up some debts because I don't want to buy a home and then have debt on top of it I just I rather just buy my home and pay for that and maybe have my student loan to still pay for it because God knows it takes forever to clear up your student loan so I'm not too worried about that so put the tracker there mortgage is getting $10 and this is my first cash stuff for this one, so I, it's not too much counting. It's legit just the $10 going in. I'm going to actually leave it open because I'll update the tracker after. So property tax will also be getting Utilities will be getting ten dollars as well. So I'll just put two fives. Electricity will also be getting ten dollars. That is another two five. And the one thing that I didn't put, um, I didn't make an envelope for homeowners insurance, but I'm almost positive that um, I could also include that as a part of my mortgage. I'm not too sure, still kind of researching um living room will be getting five dollars and then bedrooms will be getting 15. We'll be getting five dollars. Okay. And then last is bathroom and bathrooms. Bathrooms. Because I definitely do not want to purchase a home that has one bathroom, that's for sure. So five dollars and i'm so excited about this binder this binder is like it's everything for me because i'm definitely so excited to home ownership i could just like taste it so that is pretty much it for today's cash stuffing i hope you guys enjoy and i hope you are inspired to also create your home binder if you does your own home binder if you too also desire to uh, purchase a home in the near future so that is it for my two binders i am just going to go ahead and fill in my trackers off camera but until next time and as always stay blessed bye y'all